channel so today's video is going to be a pin collection video um i've got my desk my desk lamp on it's okay it's over there it's, it's like blinding me <laughs> you can probably see the light reflection in my eyes but i've got it on today because you know it's not a sunny day today and i am recording this so it was quite dark in here so i just put my desk light on because i don't want my light on because you know i don't need my light on it's not not dark dark on the camera it was dark and this might be the first thing I video with my hair up, I really don't know and you can see that my roots are really really bad I've just had a shower so that's why it's a lot of it up so it can dry um, but yeah my roots are really really bad it doesn't matter because I do not want to stay purple <laughs> anyway so but yeah that's cool about today's video it's a pink collection video so I'm just going to start babbling and I'm going to get on with the video. Okay, so first things first, I'm just going to talk about the lanyard. I'll show it from the back because the back is definitely much better than the front. So, it's got like these lovely uh, swirls and twirls and it's got a few flowers on there. So yeah, we love that. Looking good. And then we have princesses down at the bottom. They are on the front as well, but obviously because there's pins on them, you cannot see them. So we have Jasmine, Joanna, Bell, Cinderella. Ariel and Aurora. So yeah, that's lovely. Then down the bottom one here, it just has Disney Princess. And yeah, so I got this lanyard in 2011, the first time I went to Walt Disney World. So let's get on to the pins. I'm a weirdo, if you can't tell already from other videos. <laughs> but anyway, the first pin that I've had is this Minnie Mouse one. Oh my god, his focus is so... I tried recording this one before as well, and it wasn't good, but it focuses so much better with this desk lamp. Oh, I'm really glad I've decided to turn it on. But yeah, it's this lovely Minnie Mouse one, so she just sat down, and um, she's in a red outfit. And she got her hand clasped together, and there's just some red hearts near her. And yeah, I don't remember where I got this one from. These are little Harris. It was hanging around in my room for absolutely ages before, like before we knew pin trading was a thing in Walt Disney World so yeah she has fast pens I must have got her 8 or 9 when I went to Disney World in 2008 or 2009 I don't know I can't remember but yeah that was where she was from she, and that definitely was the first pen I ever had and then the next one I'm just going to go up in order but the next one is a brave pen I don't really know how to hold this one out so I'm just going to And this is brave pin and it's got married on it and it's a nice goldy colour and I just uh, said didn't put my brave on it um I got this one from Disneyland Paris oh, not that one this one <laughs> I got this one from Disneyland Paris when I went in it was either 2013 or 2015 because when I went to Walt Disney World for the first time brave was not out so that's how I know that is from Disneyland and Paris we have the one. I don't, this one's not focusing very well there you go and yeah, she's just really cute. And then we've got the umbrella behind her. And it actually spins. And it's got flowers on it. And it's just super, super cute. If I leave her down. I don't know if you can see that. We'll go with it. And the next one on my list is one of my favourite princesses. And each one is Punzi. Rapunzel, now she is super, super cute, she's just brushing her hair there, and yeah, yeah, um, I got that from this one, and that one, from Walt Disney World, yeah, because, you know, that I got most of my purchases from Walt Disney World the first time I went, most of these ones on this lanyard, anyway, so moving on to the next one, this is it on an Elsa one, and it just says Frozen, Oh yeah, and it's in heart shape. I thought it was really cute. Um, I got this Christmas time. Christmas time? Yeah, Christmas time 2015. And yeah, um, I just wanted needed Anna and Elsa to finish up my princess collection. You'll see what I mean. When I show you all my other pins. But yeah, I just love it. And you know, I was obsessed with Frozen then. I mean, I still am now. I love the film so much. Um, Yeah, I was obsessed with Frozen. So I needed a Frozen badge. Of course I did. And next... <laughs> We have little Alice. So we say hi Alice. I'm just going to focus 
Alice no we're not. I'm really sorry. I have bad nails. I bite my nails and Alice's back just fell off. Wonderful. Um, yeah, I have a really bad habit of biting my nails. Um, my nails are very... Lockdown has been it worth, to be honest. Oh my goodness. Oh, Tiana's fell off. Anyway, this is Alice. Alice is one of, Alice in Wonderland is one of my favourite Disney films. So yeah, I just thought it'd be cute. Alice on there. And the next badge is a Gryffindor badge. Um, I got this badge in 2011 in Walt Disney World, like so same as Alice. Not Walt Disney World. Um, Alice was from Walt Disney World. Gryffindor was obviously from Universal Studios in Orlando. So yeah, I hadn't taken the plot quick, so I didn't know what house I am in. But I am actually in Slytherin, if anyone wanted to know that. Um, Slytherin. And then Marie. We love Marie. Marie is one of my favourite characters. Alistair Cuts is one of my favourite movies also. I can't remember actually where I got her from, so I'm just going to have a little sneak peek. I think she was from Disney World. Yeah, no, what does that say? I think she was from Disney World, actually. I'm not too sure. But yeah, Marie is just a little cutie, isn't she? So, yeah, um, I'm just going to pick Tiana up quickly before I end up stepping on her because that was not very nice. But she is the next one to show you anyway, so I'll have to put her on. So then I went on to the other side of this lanyard. So we've got Tiana, so we're going to break it. But yeah, I just love her in this green dress. Yeah, I love her in her green dress, it's just super, super cute. And Tiana is naturally a very underrated princess. She's amazing. And the news actually came out the other day that they're making Splash Mountain into a Princess and the Frog film ride. And I'm very excited for that. I love Princess and the Frog. And I think it's amazing that they're doing another princess ride. So yeah, I'm really happy. And the next badge I have is this I Love one here. This was also bought at Christmas 2015. Clearly because he's in a Christmas hat and he's in a Christmas present. I just thought it was the best way. It was a nice way to like remember that I'd been to Disneyland Paris for Christmas in 2015. So yeah, that was brilliant. And the next one, Princess Collection, of course, is Pocahontas. But yeah, I, this is one of my favourite pens. I just I love Pocahontas so much, and her hair is just going off in the distance, and it's just super cute, super cute, and like you know, Colours of the Wind is such a good jam. I like just find the ribbon band as well, but Colours of the Wind is my favourite song, and. John Smith is... Mm, I don't know. I don't even know what I was saying. Next pin is the Princess one. With like, basically all the ones that are mainly on the lanyard. It's not focusing. So yeah, you have Aurora, Cinderella, Jasmine, Ariel, Snow White and Belle. And yeah, I just thought that's the best way to, you know, get these princesses. And then I would just get the ones that aren't on it on their own, so that's why I did get the other ones for the princess collection. But my favourite princess is Sleeping Beauty, you probably already know that, so I'm just probably going to get some more Aurora and Rapunzel. But is next time I go to a Disney park, just because they, these two, those two are my favourite. So the next pin I have is a little special one. I thought some of fell off again, it didn't, it's, it's, it's all good. It's the next special one. Um, so this is a New York one, and it's just got Mickey and Minnie on it, and it's in they're obviously in New York, um, it's in the shape of an apple, because New York is a big apple. But yeah, I went to New York on a school trip in 2017 when I was in year 11, and I bought that from the Disney store, it was just a lot of way to remind me of my first and only time in New York. So, and then I do have another lanyard because we went to Walt Disney World again in 2018, we don't really, we don't do, we don't pin trade, we just, <laughs> we just really collect the pins that we like ourselves. And then we just put it on a lanchard. A lanchard? Oh, I can't speak. Lanyard. Yeah. So this one is just a mini mouse one. So you just got a lovely mini there. And then, if I open that up, it says mini mouse here. So yeah, it's just really cute. And it's just red. And it has polka dots on it. So the first that I will show you is this Moana one. Now this definitely finishes off my... Let's call up that. Um, but yeah, there's me on it there. There we go. And yeah, she's just beautiful. It just says Moana. And Moana. Oh, I love that film so much with all my heart. 
that, so I did definitely have to get a Moana badge. Um, so the next one is a SeaWorld badge. Um, basically the story behind this badge is we just, me went to Discovery Cove, I got a jumper for that, and we swam with the dolphins and everything. And we got a free day for SeaWorld as well, so you know, we just went there because it was free. We got it for free with our package, so yeah, couldn't not go. Um, but it wasn't it wasn't that great in my opinion. I'm probably not going to go again. Um, like there was there's rides there. Like the animals are, the animals were beautiful. Like don't get me wrong. There were some dolphins there as well, obviously. Um, but the rides just they like, kept breaking down. Me and my mum was just queuing up to go to the rides, and they just kept breaking down. And we were like, this ain't this ain't good. So I don't know. It just wasn't my favourite place. And then I've heard that they're not nice since like I got back. I heard that they don't treat the animals right and. I'm not really sure, I need to research into it, but I'm never going to go again. I'm so I'm not going again. Um, we'll go to, so this little pin at the top here, it's this little giraffe, um, it just says Noah's Ark Zoo Park, it's really small so you won't be able to say that, but giraffe is my favourite animal, um, and my family went to the Noah's Ark Park on holiday in 2017, but I stayed home because I was in a show, I think it was, I was in Annie like a summer show thing so I stayed home so I could do that and they went on holiday so yeah so they brought me that you know just to get me like a little souvenir they got me some other stuff as well I really can't remember but yeah that's just and I just popped it on here because it's the pin and I didn't want to lose it like in my room so I've just put it on here for now anyway and then we have this Bambi pin and it says Bambi and Thumper and it says best friends on it and I got this in Disneyland Paris so it would have been 2018 when I went for my 18th birthday. But yeah, we love it. Bambi is my second favourite Disney film. And yeah, I love it. And then last but not least, the last pin. We got a Simba. So this one was from Walt Disney World in 2018. And I don't know, I just love it so much. And I thought it was so, so cute. And Lion King is also one of my favourite Disney films. I mean, I love I love all Disney films. But like, Lion King is a classic. And it's one of my favourite ones. And... Yeah, I just love it. So I've got this little simple one. So yeah, maybe when I go to Disneyland Paris soon, I'm gonna get some more pin collections. Like I, some pin collections, some more pins. Like I said, we don't really um, we don't pin directly. <laughs> don't <remember> that. <laughs> we don't trade them. We just collect the ones like of characters that we love as such, just because. I know, I'd be a bit awkward when it comes to pin trading. Oh, cannot speak. I'd be a bit awkward when it comes to pin trading if I'm being completely honest. But yeah. So you'll probably be seeing this video a lot later than I've recorded it. I kind of just record it as a backup. Like I do want to post it at some point. But I don't know. Recent videos, I don't want to even have purple hair anymore. I really don't know. I just record it as like a backup, you know, in case. So this might even be up when I'm back at uni. I really don't know when it's going to be up. But I know I definitely want to record one. And I know Kyle's going to record one soon. Or he might have already put his up. I don't know. I don't know when you're going to see this. But yeah, it's still due right now. But yeah, I just thought I'd record this. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, then don't forget to give it a like or a comment. And share it if you really want to. I mean, go ahead. <laughs> yeah so and also don't forget to subscribe if you enjoyed this video and not already subscribed because I am pretty sure there will be loads more Disney content coming up we are going to Disneyland Paris soon hopefully fingers crossed that we are going to Disneyland Paris soon so yeah I'm really excited for that but yeah I'm just waffling on again. I will go now and thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye! Hi everyone, welcome back to... I'm going to try that again. Oh, no. I need to be careful with the camera because she comes off quite a bit. I'm, oh, I think this is, oh, I don't know how to focus this pen. Pen, focus.
Hello, are you on a fire cash? No, it's not. This is really hard. I should have taken them off. This is really hard. <laughs>